I'm sure they probably thought it was just a normal football injury, but just seeing the way that he fell and the way that his body just was laying there, I'm sure most of them were probably terrified because I think I would have been if I was there in person. A Monday night this football game Bills between team. the Cincinnati Bengals and Buffalo Bills took a turn for the worst in the first quarter when Bills safety DeMar Hamlin collapsed after suffering cardiac arrest. Medical experts surrounding him within seconds to perform life-saving measures like CPR before he's rushed to the hospital. And while there was medical staff on hand for Hamlin, that's not always the case when medical emergencies occur. That's why CPR instructors are urging folks to get CPR certified. That way, if they need a way for first responders, um, you give them a little bit more chance of surviving by being able to be their first responder on the scene and giving them CPR. Devier Lewis is a local CPR instructor who says there have been several occurrences where everyday civilians have had to jump in and administer CPR. She says hopefully the incident that occurred Monday will remind folks that this kind of thing can happen to anyone at any time and at any place. There's quite a few steps in CPR. It's not just putting your hands over someone's chest and pushing in. You have to know how many seconds in between. If you have to give breaths, um, how far down you have to go. You need to know the position of giving CPR because if not, you can damage more than what the problem is that they're already going through. Lewis says CPR is a life skill we all should know, especially now seeing on a big stage the difference it makes. For his family, I know they were scared because it's probably something that's not normal for him. He's probably in good health. So sign up for a class. It's worth it. It's just two hours of your time and it's not very expensive. Because those two hours could prepare you to save a life.